Hey, what's up, buddy? <laughs> Welcome to this very first episode of Ask Brad. Mr. Advice is on a uh, much needed vacation, so I, Brad, will be taking over, answering a couple of your questions. <laughs> you hear that sound I'm making? That's the sound that Chad. That's the sound I. Uh, that's the sound I make when Chad shoves his finger up my fucking ass. <laughs> whoa, whoa, yeah. Time to answer a couple of these questions and we're gonna get this started. <laughs> First question comes from Sir Giggles. Yo, fit, yo, what's good? This girl I used to work with finally decided to fuck me. <laughs> she says her tubes are tied after having five kids. I want the real feel. Cause she is super hot and sexy. Just like good old Brad with the douchebag shirt on. Should I go for it? Or should I wear protection just in case? Get back at me. Wink wink. <laughs> well, you're playing with fire and ice here, buddy. This is a double-edged sword. Me, Brad, I don't care. See, I get fucked up the ass raw. Hey, I fucked Chad's mom and dad up the ass fucking raw. But here's the thing you gotta do, buddy. Um, okay, if that's the case, it would be best if maybe you get, maybe she should get a fucking AIDS test, okay, a blood test, whatever, make sure she's healthy enough, that way, you'll be able to fuck her raw, all night and all day, just like I do with Melissa, the stupid cunt bitch, ooh, ooh, I'm thinking of Chad shoving his dick on my ass, ooh, Next question comes from Big Pendejo. Excuse me, I gotta put my douchebag music back on because that shit was fucking catchy. <laughs> Big Pendejo, so t today I cut summer school and stood home in my room. My mom never knew I stood home and my mom was talking to someone on the phone and she was talking shit about me. She said she, she said that I was a mistake and she does not like how my ebony ass came out and she wishes she never had me. And then I was sad all day. I don't know what to do. I feel like killing myself. What should I do? <laughs> what should you do? Do we do do? What you should do is, fuck your mother, fuck that bitch. Okay, you show her that, 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 that you're not a mistake, okay? You show her that you can go out there, get good grades, maybe even join the football team. Maybe be a good sports athlete. You show, you pick yourself up. Stop being sad. Fuck that bitch. You're your own human being. You're your own person. You do what makes you happy, and I guarantee you, you'll be getting a shitload of cheers from the cheerleader squad. <laughs> Our next question comes from the free subs 12. So I was bored in school, so I decided to use my pencil and scrape the residue from my anus. I licked the pencil multi multiple times until my teacher came over to me, took the pencil and smelled it. He decided to take me to the office. I got suspended for the day. But the next day I, I caught him doing the same thing, except this time adding grape jam on the pencil for flavor. Should I go report him? Please help. Uh, by the way, I still use that pencil. <laughs> Let me tell you something. I would love to take that pencil and shove it up Chad's tight white ass. <laughs> Let me put up some more sports music over here. Yeah, I'm gonna repeat the same song over and over. Here's what you should do. Uh, stop using that pencil first of all, cause it's full of shit, okay? And you're gonna uh, get feces virus and shit like that. Uh, just, it, this is pretty fucking disgusting, by the way. Scraping the residue from your anus and licking the pencil multiple times. I think, I don't know why you can, maybe you should have reported him. This is just a fucked up situation. I don't, I don't even know what to fucking think about this. Cause I'm just so turned on by shoving pencils up Chad's fucking tight white ass. And our last question comes from Opinion Maker 464 By the way, sorry Free Subs 12. I couldn't help you out on your question. Opinion Maker 464, I have a problem. There's this girl I want to get with. She's white and she's cute as fuck. 
The problem is she's thinking I'm a jock just because I'm on the football team. Ooh. And she hates jocks. How can I prove that I'm not a jock? Thanks, man. Well, if she can't accept the fact, if she can't accept you for who you are, fuck the bitch. Okay, you pass it over to me. The only thing I can tell you over here, buddy, is um, she's stereotyping you for the wrong reasons. Okay? And besides, wh who would be ashamed uh, to be looked on as a jock? I mean, look how fucking cool I look. Tight ass fucking polo, pop collar, sunshades, fresh cut. Oh, yeah. What girl wouldn't love to go out with Brad? <laughs> That's it for this edition of Ask Brad. Make sure you have any questions you ask me. <laughs>